So in Hypixel Skyblock, in-game currency is one of the most important things. Well, the more of it you have, the richer you are. But you know, as an experiment, I decided what if I made a profile where I'm not allowed to get any money whatsoever? What issues will I face along my journey? Well, stick around to find out. Of course, I can't do everything in one video, so this is probably going to become a series. Well, consider this episode one. Anyways, I'm on a new profile. I have nothing unlocked at all. Well, I just want to see how far I can get. So, well, I think it's time we get started. Anyways, of course, the first thing you do on a Skyblock profile you got a speed bridge it's just how it works also i will grab the cobblestone that's gened up in this already also if you're not subscribed and you do want to subscribe that would greatly help out the channel anyways let's get started so i think one of the challenges that we're gonna face is not being able to just buy anything from auction house now normally if i wanted i could just go and buy some minor armor it pretty much sells for nothing except on this profile i'm not allowed to get any money so i'm gonna have to collect it by myself now the one good thing is i am able to trade things with other players since it technically doesn't actually involve money, I could like say, oh, I'll give you 23 cobblestone for uh, 9 wood. So it is still worth it to have minions, even if I can't just sell the profits they make. And I'm pretty sure this one, yeah, this will give me the rogue sword, so now I can get some speed going. And I also want to find the one that gives me a pickaxe. Oh, I'm dumb. It took me this long to realize that I just bought this pickaxe to get started. And say goodbye to that profile. Alright, attempt number two. Let's just make sure we don't actually use coins in our purse. You know, I like we're less than like 10 minutes into the challenge and we already failed. It's fine though, this time we won't. Now I want to check this chest down here. It might give me some good stuff. Yeah, we got some cobblestone and I don't really care about the rest of this. But using this, I can get myself some stone tools. You know, Hypixel Skybox makes it way too easy. You can just go there and you can just buy yourself a gold pickaxe. But now I've got to go straight to a stone pickaxe and then work my way up. I am not going to like this. And we're finally back to the village. Let's get our rogue sword and let's head off to the mines again. Now, while I'm mining, I might as well talk about our plans when it comes to minions. I think rather than trying to get like diamond minions and clay minions like I did on my main profile, because money doesn't matter on this account, I think I might try to get resources that are in high demand. And then using those, I can trade them with other players for like good items. Honestly, I think starting off this profile is going to be the hardest because it's going to be hard to find people who want to trade like 29 coal for something that I need. So pretty much doing trades is out of the question. I pretty much just rely on collecting stuff by myself. I just realized, if I want to put telekinesis on a thing, it's going to cost 100 coins. So literally the only way I can get it is from enchanting. Oh, this is going to be painful. Oh wait, I can find the lazy miner pickaxe, can't I? Oh, where are you at? Yes. Yes. That should give me smelting touch, and I'm I'm pretty sure that's free. Now I've got an iron pickaxe, so we're, we're chilling for now. And we still haven't spent a single coin. Now tell me I should reach mining level 5, so I think I'm gonna do that because if I'm not mistaken, that'll get me access to the deep mines. Well, that's where I get diamonds for diamond armor, and then eventually I can get some miner armor. there we go we hit mining level five so now we can go to the deep mines now because money doesn't really matter for me i'm gonna do what all the speedrunners do and use an exploit that allows me to get straight down to the diamond mines now pretty much if you're speedrunning the game what you want to do you go down to the lift operator you click it once and then you run over here and there's an exploit you can do to unlock every single mine now normally i would just try to go mining for some more gold get money and then buy like some good armor to defend myself but i think the best armor we can get the fastest is actually just gonna be diamond armor so i'm pretty pretty sure it's gonna be right over in this corner that's gonna work it doesn't matter if i have any coins in my purse because i can't actually use any of those and there we go look at this there we go pigmen slime hill diamond reserve literally doing this on my main profile probably took like half an hour just to get all the way down to the diamond reserve and it took us like two seconds now i'm literally one hit to any of these guys so i just want to get my like 24 diamonds for diamond armor and then just get out of here please don't hit me don't hit me don't hit me oh are you kidding this is actually gonna take a while I just need one more. Yes, I got one. No, I don't. I need one more. No. 
All right, there, we got it. Let's go to the lapis mines and get us some lapis armor after this. There we go. Now we're fully kitted out with just basic diamond armor. And now hopefully by using this, I can kill some of these lapis zombies and hope I can get lapis armor. Now I would go buy a sword from like the shop or anything, but you know, I can't really. So I've been farming these zombies for like 5 or 10 minutes now, and I haven't gotten a single piece of armor. So I think rather than focusing on trying to get better armor, I'm just going to work on getting better minions. So I know Lapis is in relatively high demand, so I think rather than trying to kill the zombies here, I'm just going to try to unlock some Lapis minions. You know, I'm going to be honest, not having telekinesis is really annoying. People can just come by and yoink your items. I mean, I've got like 100 coins in my purse, but I... It's part of the challenge. I can't buy it. And there we go. We unlocked the Lapis Minion. And I think we do have enough to craft like one or two of them. So there we go. We got our first Lapis Minion. You know, I'm just gonna go make him a little area right out here. Place him down and he'll start generating us some resources. Now I do want to upgrade him a little bit, but it'll cost us quite a lot considering I can't use any of my money to buy Lapis. You know, just to be safe, I'm gonna put all the coins I get in the bank and literally never take them out. Now I think the next thing I should do is try to work on upgrading this Minion because he's gonna be our main profit farm. And well, to do this, I'm gonna need to mine a lot more lapis. But without having telekinesis, it's really difficult. So I'm gonna go on a quest to try to find an enchanting table and enchant a pickaxe with telekinesis. And then finally, I can upgrade you. Now there's multiple different things that I'm gonna need, and the first thing I'm gonna do is try to get a book. Now of course, I could go buy it from like the librarian over there. And well, we can't really spend coins on anything. So you know, we're gonna have to go all the way over there to get ourselves a book. You know, for something that costs us like two coins in like two seconds to get, it's quite the extra process. Now if you want to gain your farming level up quickly and you just are starting off, a little trick you can do is you go find a lobby by yourself where none of the wheat is mined in the main lobby and you go mine up all that for easy wheat levels. So there's like only like four people here. I doubt anything's going to be taken. Well, let's go mine this up. Ah uh, yes, fresh farm fields. We unlocked farming level five. You know, had I done it at the barn and not the main island like I did, it probably would have taken like double or triple the time. So now we can finally go over to the mushroom desert and as you can see, there is sugar cane over here. All that just for me to collect like 13 sugar cane and call it good. Let's make the paper and let's make the book. Now for the rest of the enchanting table, we'll need to go all the way down to the obsidian sanctuary. All right, so we got what we need diamonds wise, but I still need to get four obsidian, which is gonna be relatively difficult. Come on, I just need four obby. It's not that hard. I think I'm still one shot down here though. That took way too long to mine, but we have one. All right, we got another. We, we just need two more. Please. Yes, yes, I will. Can I just stand right next to you, buddy? No, 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 don't run. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Ah, oh, are you kidding? Yes, yes, we got what we need. Get me out of here, get me out of here. But now I believe we have literally everything we need. There we go, the enchanting table has been acquired. You know, don't even get me started on trying to get bookshelves. That's gonna be an entirely new process. Telekinesis is an enchant that we can get. So, you know, I, I don't really care about efficiency or anything. I'm just gonna get the guaranteed telekinesis. You know, eventually I can put efficiency five by using like an anvil to combine it. But now we don't have to get our, any of our drops stolen. They'll go straight into our inventory. Also, I'm gonna grab all the blocks this minion gen. I think I get more blocks than what he gets from mining them. And I need like only eight stacks or so to upgrade him. And then I'd say we're good. So I just got eight stacks and now I'm gonna head back to my island and hopefully this should be enough to upgrade this minion to level two. Yep, there we go. Now I've got three open slots for it, but if I wanna upgrade another time, I'm gonna need enchanted lapis. Well, that's gonna take quite a lot of time to get. So that's just about gonna wrap things up for our first video on this profile. I'd say we got quite a good start. Now off camera, I do wanna go mining, try to get some lapis armor because that's gonna do a lot better than this diamond armor that we have going right now. And then I'm also gonna try to upgrade our minions. Of course, with that said, I hope you all did enjoy the video. If you did, please hit the like button. And with that said, thank you all for watching and have a wonderful rest of your day.